Let's discuss a brief introduction of assembly language in context of ARM Cortex M4 microcontroller with Microvision Keel 2 chain. Every computer has a microprocessor that manages the computer arithmetic, logical, and control activities. A computer program is a collection of numbers stored in memory in the form of ones and zeros. The microprocessor reads these numbers one at a time, decodes them, and performs the required action. We term these binary strings as a machine code. Although machine language instructions make perfect sense to computer, but humans cannot comprehend them. A long time ago, someone came up with the idea that computer program can be written using words instead of binary strings. So a new language of mnemonics was developed and is called assembly language. An assembly language is a low level programming language and there is a very strong correspondence between the language and architecture's machine code instructions. Assembly language instructions make perfect sense to human but computer cannot understand it. Therefore, we need a computer program that can translate the source code written in assembly language into the machine language code. The input to the assembler is the assembly language source file and it output executable object code containing machine code. It is very important to note that assembly language programs are not portable because assembly language instructions are specific to computer architecture. Similarly, a different assembler is required to make an object code for each platform. As we discussed that assembly language instructions strongly depend on the microprocessor's architecture. Therefore, we need to discuss about the architecture of ARM Cortex M4. The ARM Cortex M4 is a reduced instruction set computer with relatively simple implementation of load store architecture, where operations are performed only on CPU registers and dedicated load and store instructions are used to transfer data between main RAM and CPU registers. ARM sports a small number of addressing modes and all load store addresses being determined from registers and instructions field only. Cortex M4 architecture provides 16 read write 32 bit registers numbered from R0 to R15. The register R0 to R12 are general purpose registers. And the last three registers have special hardware significance. The general purpose registers have no special architectural defined uses. Register R0 to R7 are called low registers and are accessible by all instructions. And register R8 to R12 are called high register and are only accessible by 32-bit instructions that specify a general purpose register. Register 13, also known as stack pointer, is the register that holds the address of top element of the program stack. It is used automatically in the push and pop instructions to manage storage and recovery of registers in the stack. Register 14, also known as link register, holds the return address from program counter when a branch and link or branch and link with exchange instruction is executed. And the last register 15 also known as program counter. It holds the current program address. On reset, the processor loads the program counter with the value of reset vector which is an address of hex 4. The program counter register 
can be accessed in either privileged or unprivileged mode. Let's talk a little about Cortex M4 assembler. This shows the ARM software development flow and the shaded portion highlight the most common assembler development path. The assembler accepts assembly language source files, both those you create and those created by ARM C, C++ compiler. The ARM assembler translates assembly language source files into machine language object files. These files are the object module and the linker creates executable object files from the object modules. These executable object files can be executed by ARM devices. The ARM assembler source files can contain the following assembly language elements. Assembler directives, assembly language instructions, and macro directives. In this video, we discuss the basics of assembly language and uh, ARM Cortex-M4 microcontroller architecture. We also briefly discussed about uh, the ARM assembler. In the next video, we will discuss about uh, different assembler directives that are a part of the source file for the ARM assembler. If you have any questions, you can ask it in comments. Thank you.